Charlie! Is there something more interesting going on outside than in here? Yes. Don't be fresh. You just earned yourself a trip to the doghouse. You know what a check mark means. And I don't want to have to do that. Girls, make sure you give this to your parents or legal guardians. They're very important. Charlie, what did you get for problem six? Hmm? I hope those are notes you're taking. This is not art class, Charlie. Oh. Hi, Ed. A little late, Maxie? Yes, and I ran right into that darn sidewalk crack. What did it to my heel? This would have happened if I didn't sleep right through my alarm clock and wasn't in a rush to open up the salon. Did I miss any customers? Didn't miss one, Miss Maxie. Why would I even bother asking? Thank you for the breakfast, Miss Maxie. Enjoy it. I have something very special in mind for you. I hope so, because I don't have time to waste. <laughs> You'll love it, I promise. Great. So, what do you think? No. No, it's too bland. No, I'm looking for something sexy, not school mom. Sexy. What do you think? I asked for sexy, not slutty. Just tone it down a bit. Sure. I'm at no loss for ideas. That's why they called me Maximum Maxia Cosmetology School. <laughs> My mom was so proud of me. She carried on as but I Nobel really piece. need to get moving on this. I can't afford to miss my Swedish massage appointment this afternoon. Gregory was playing a bit rough with me the other day, and as a result, I pulled a muscle in my neck. Hey, at least he still got the hots for you. By the end of our marriage, my ex was frisky with everyone but me. Gregory is my golden retriever. Right, um, tone down. I think we are having a breakdown in communication. Can you give me what I want or not? Sure. Sure I can. I'm Maxima Maxi. So what do you think now? I like it. How much do I owe you? Truthfully, you couldn't pay me enough for what you just put me through, but considering the communication problem, how's $50? $50? Fair enough. Here's the $50. And here's a little something for all your trouble. Maybe you were right, Bruno. Maybe the salon is more than I can handle. God knows you were. Bruno? Bruno! some credentials. Slowly. <laughs> you're a Chulis gum representative? Chulis? And you're stirring up all this anti-smoking sentiment. To what? Sell more gum? <clears throat> Get out of here. Something like 36? What? Something like 36? Oh, you boys. Wait, what is that anyway? Something like 36? Does that include me? Um, 37. 